Hello everybody. Today we are going to see how to perform a lookup operations in Clover ETN. So we have two files. I am going to use the same two files which I have used in the join operation. In the input employee input file which is the first input file uh, we have an employee data which also contains a state and state is uh, defined as a full name of the state and the other file which is the US states input it has a short code of a state and the full name so what we want is we want this field in our output based on the state mentioned here so let's see how we can achieve this in clover ATL. in clover ATL, i have already configured the universal data reader component uh, wherein i have given the path of the file and metadata of the file so the, the file is already loaded into this component to perform a lookup operation on the clover ATL. The first thing we need to do is we need to define the lookup in the outline section so right now we don't have any lookup in this so we need to first define the lookup right click on the lookups in the outline and select create internal lookup now there are a couple of options for creating a lookup right now we'll consider only on the sim simple look lookup the rest of the lookups i'll uh, cover in a separate video so click next and give the name of the lookup let's give it okay. And give the metadata so I have already created a metadata for the states file which I covered in the last video so, so I have selected this metadata and key so for defining a key it is a key for from which the data will be matched with the main file so here we are going to take the full name of a state and drag it as a part of the key and in the data source we have to provide path of a file click on finish now drag the lookup Join component into the designer and join the edges. Okay, here we will also give the metadata as a employee input file. Drag the trash component. Trash component is to just show how the data is flowing from one component to another. And here I have already created a metadata which is join output. Basically, it contains the short form state uh, along with the data from here. Now we are going to come configure the lookup join. The first thing we are going to do here is to define the lookup table that we have recently created in the outline section. So select the lookup table here, state lookup. And the second thing is we have to give the join key from the main data. We have already defined the join key in the lookup table. Now we are going to define lookup uh, join key from the main data. Click OK. And what kind of join we want? We want a laptop to join or a inner join. So let's say we want a laptop to join here. So click on true. And the last thing is the transformation. How the data will be transformed from source to target. We are going to map ID with employee ID. First name and last name with the name. And state with the state. and postal from a different that's a state abbreviation from a second file or the lookup file and click on ok now our transformation is ready let's add the debugger here enable debug enable debug and run the job let's see our input data and it shows it's, it shows us the full name of the state and let's see the target data and here we have a short state code as well so it has done a lookup operation and find out the correct value of short code of a state from a second file. Please let me know your comments or if you have any questions.